Welcome to the channel The Nurse. Here we are discussing about Communicable Disease Cues. This is the sixth part of ESIC Staff Nurse Exam Model Papers. And if you are not subscribed to our channel, please subscribe. In upcoming days, there is so many exams are coming that is AIMS exam, Saptadeng exam, BHU exam, and ESIC exam. So prepare well. And question starts now. First question Infectivity of chicken box lasts for till the last scarf falls off, six days after onset of rash, three days after onset of rash, till the fever subsides. Correct answer is six days after onset of rash. Period of communicability of chicken box is from 1 to 2 days before to 4 to 5 days after appearance of rash. Incubation period of chicken box is about 14 to 16 days. Next question. Secondary attack rate of chicken box is 60%, 50%, 40% and 90 percentage correct answer is 90 percentage in healthy persons clinical illness after re-exposure is rare such illness is more likely to occur among immunocompromised persons however as with other viral disease re-exposure to wild type varicella often leads to reinfection thus boost antibody titers without causing clinical illness or detectable viremia. Next question Shingles is caused by Variola major, varicella zoster virus, cytomegalus virus, toxoplasma. Correct answer is varicella zoster virus. Shingles is caused by the reactivation of the varicella zoster virus that is person might suffered with chicken box infection earlier. Next question. Coplic spots are seen in prodromal period, incubation period, eruptive stage, convalescent period. Correct answer is prodromal period. Measles can be divided into four phases incubation phase, prodromal or catarrhal phase, rash phase, recovery phase. Coplic spot means the tiny pinpoint blue white spots begin as a few lesions on the inside of the cheeks. Next question Most common cause of death due to measles? Pneumonia. Secondary bacterial infection, measles encephalitis, otitis media. Correct answer is secondary bacterial infection. It appears that measles virus suppresses cell mediated immune responses, which may explain why secondary bacterial infection occur. In addition, neutropenia may accompany measles. Next question. Recommended vaccination strategy for rubella is to vaccinate first and foremost. Women 15 to 14 years, 49 years, infants, adolescent girls, children 1 to 14 years. Correct answer is women 15 to 49 years. Priority groups for rubella vaccination in India. First priority. 15 to 49 years reproductive age group females. Second priority all children 1 to 14 years age. Third priority routine universal immunization for all children aged 1. Next question Treatment choice for diphtheria is erythromycin, tetracycline, cholestine, DPT. 
correct answer is erythromycin. The antibiotics of choice are macrolides or in that erythromycin is a drug of choice. It is given through orally or by injection but penicillin also used to treat as first line drug of choice when suspected resistant to erythromycin. Next question. Most serious complication of measles. Coplic spot, parotitis, meningoencephalitis, nephritis. Correct answer is meningoencephalitis. Meningoencephalitis. This can happen as a result of the brain become, becoming infected with the virus during the rash phase of the illness or by an immune mediated brain inflammation subsequent to measles infection. Next question. Most common complication of mumps in children is pneumonia, pancreatitis, aseptic meningitis, encephalitis. Correct answer is aseptic meningitis. Aseptic meningitis is the inflammation of the meninges that is a membrane covering the brain and spinal cord in patient whose CSF test result is negative with routine bacterial cultures. The most common cause of aseptic meningitis is by viral infection. Other causes may include side effects from the drugs and connective tissue disorders. Next question. Incubation period of mums. 7 days, 10 days, 14 days, 18 days. Correct answer is 18 days. Next question. Which type of sample can be used to isolate polio virus earliest? Stool, blood, throat or CSF? Correct answer is stool. Polio virus usually can be found in the feces from the onset to less than 8 weeks after paralysis with the highest probability of detection during the first 2 weeks after paralysis onset. Next question. Incubation period of typhoid fever 10 to 14 days, 3 to 5 days, 21 to 25 days, less than 3 days. Correct answer is 10 to 14 days. Next question. Best disinfectant for cholera is bleaching powder, cresol, coal tar, formalin. Correct answer is cresol. The 5 percentage cresol is used to disinfect the stool vomit us and clean the floor and 2.5% cresol is used for disinfection of cloths, utensil, etc. The soaking time or contact time required for disinfection is half an hour that is important for disinfection. Next question. Urban malaria is due to Anophilus stephensi Anophilus virus, Culex, Phlebotomus. Correct answer is Anophilus stephensi. Anophilus stephensi is a primary mosquito vector of malaria in urban India and the Mid Middle East. Next question. Rabies free country China, Australia, Russia. France. Correct answer is Australia. Next question. Bite of which of the following animals does not result in human rabies? Dog, horse, mouse, cat. Correct answer is mouse. Next question. 
which virus is used to produce rabies vaccine wild street fixed live attenuated correct answer is fixed virus the fixed virus is a laboratory passage attenuated virus with predictable properties in terms of incubation period pathological and clinical effects in contrast the virus isolated from naturally infected animals is termed as street virus next question plaque is transmitted by heart tick soft tick rat flea louse correct answer is rat flea next question hiv post prophylaxis should be started within 24 hour 48 hours 72 hours 6 hours correct answer is 72 hours post exposure prophylaxis or pep is not effective when given more than 72 hours after exposure next question most effective to prevent hiv vertical transmission is hart nevirapine sidovudine elective cesarean correct answer hart next question which of the following is used to prevent transmission of hiv from infected pregnant mother to newborn child lamivudine nevirapine indavudin didanosin correct answer is nevirapin next question true about post exposure prophylaxis of hiv is should be given in 5 days of exposure single dose of nevirapin prevent mother to child transmission given for 2 weeks standard protocol is used to any two nrts with no other drugs correct answer is single dose of nevirapin prevent mother to child transmission post exposure prophylaxis in hiv it should be given in 3 days or 72 hours of exposure regimen with two dr two drugs is effective but three drugs regimen is preferred a complete course of post exposure prophylaxis comprises 28 days of medicines nevirapine single dose of 200 mg at labor onset to mother for child 2 mg per kg within 72 hours of birth next question average incubation period of hiv to aids transformation is 1 year 2 years 5 years 10 years correct answer is 10 years aids is a set of symptoms and illness that develop as a result of advanced hiv infection which has destroyed the immune system nowadays a better treatment to hiv infection may prevent the infection progression to aids next question in an hiv infected child which vaccine should not be given dpt opv hepatitis b typhoid vaccine correct answer is opv oral polio vaccine or opv is contraindicated in hiv infection because it may cause vaccine associated paralytic polio so here inactivated polio vaccine or ipv is administered subcutaneously for vaccination next question window period for hiv infection 3 to 12 weeks 8 to 20 weeks 6 to 24 weeks 
none of these correct answer is 3 to 12 weeks the window period is time between potential exposure to hiv infection and the point when the test will give an accurate result during the window period a person can be infected with hiv and be very infectious but still test hiv negative questions and sir thank you for watching this video please like and share this video and don't forget to subscribe this channel the news thank you